5k in jewels, another 2 in bills I'm only 18, just imagine how that feels I had to meet the folks, cause I love it to the bone Respect is everything, so I promise to have you home They said I've been living it up, I ain't a city kid And I only like my girl, cause her titties big I'm getting fat now, all I eat is double cheese Dude, you suspect, you don't mess with double D's That's a line for these niggas, that's a rhyme for these niggas I miss the nice watch I don't got time for these niggas Guaranteed they feel it And they say that you next But people gon' be people And hatin's what we do best I love y'all so much That's right, I love y'all so much And I'll forever be your mushi But I have to grow up Damn, look where I stand Never trouble my fam I respect a good woman So I'm double the man And I told her that we done If we keep on fighting, I just want that crib With a ton of recess lighting I like to say I'm thorough Find me where the hood at I lay her on the bed to remind her what I'm good at The world is right here But we don't wanna go yet Cause every time we land It's bottles of that Moet Best believe you out this world You certainly from Mercury I fell for you the first day That's our anniversary month I can't be alone I can't be alone Cause every time we break I gotta call your phone It's something I can't help I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it I don't want nobody else I can't be alone I can't be alone Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone It's something I can't help, I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it, I don't want nobody else, so See, I could never do it, I mean, I hate the scene We should make believe, tell me why you hate to dream Gunning for that one spot, shine like I'm dumb hot Flow cool, this broken heart feels like a gunshot Every time it beats, feel like I'm incomplete I'm playing for the heat, James and the giant peach So now I'm dying a hatch, we cry and we laugh I feel fly, super fly, but I fly in the back I mean, I'm balling on a budget, I know I should love it Triple kick flipping, your crew is a pop, shove it, take that when you see me pass, give me breezy back. But she was out real fast, like an easy pass. Homie, if you got it, get it, you better soak it in. I feel like I'm at the bottom of the roach again. I feel like I'm at the bottom of the ocean. Praying, hoping, wishing, floating. I can't be alone, I can't be alone. Yeah. Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone. It's something I can't help. I want you to myself. I'ma keep it where I got it. I don't want nobody else. I can't be alone, I can't be alone Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone It's something I can't help, I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it, I don't want nobody else uh. I just wanna be that man that she make it with I just wanna be that man that she take it with I ain't tryna be that man that she break it with Cause I'm so proud of our interracial relationship And everything I have is everything I'm not With a backpack full of dreams, we tryna reach the top Now love is super crucial, I don't wanna move you Love you when I hate you, girl, I don't wanna lose you I can't be alone, I can't be alone Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone It's something I can't help, I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it, I don't want nobody else I can't be alone, I can't be alone Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone It's something I can't help, I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it, I don't want nobody else so. I can't be alone, I can't be alone Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone it's something I can't help, I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it, I don't want nobody else I can't be alone, I can't be alone Cause every time we break, I gotta call your phone It's something I can't help, I want you to myself I'ma keep it where I got it, I don't want nobody else so. What's good YouTube, Gabby Boy 92 here, back again, once again, today people, today we are back for some more motherfucking sacred gold, motherfucking egg lock, motherfucking Nappy Boy 92 in this motherfucker, right now people, we are back for some more sacred gold, egg rock, and uh, a lot of you guys are just asking Nappy, what the fuck happened to Wednesday sacred gold, how come it wasn't uploaded, what's going on, <sighs> alright, see what had happened was, uh, Tuesday night I went to go and record Sacred Gold and I started recording it, everything was all good, happy lovey dovey, all that good shit and then everything just went downhill like the commentary was just shit the game started turning to shit because you know how it like freezes and pixelates and all that shit and like, I know that's that's not an excuse, like we can fix that, just open up a menu but it happened like 20 fucking times in a row 
So it was just a combination of a whole bunch of stuff. It was just like, like, like I hold myself to a certain standard when I upload content on my channel. And to me, that episode that I had recorded just wasn't up to par. That's all it was. It's just, I was just like, this is fucking stupid. This is just fucking stupid. But either way, you guys, we are here now. And, um, just so you guys know that it's not the same fucking episode that I'm recording. Because I, I can already see somebody saying, Nappy, you just got your fucking shit wrecked. You lost your egg lock, so you just tried to re-record it. Nah, nigga, because I recorded an episode on Wednesday that was 30 minutes long, and this bitch is an hour long, because it's Friday, and Friday, we have hour long episodes, but in today's episode, our goal is to obtain the next gym badge from the 5th gym leader, Chuck, so that means we're going to be making our way from Equity City to Cinewood, or Cianwood Island, or some, some shit like that, I don't remember, you guys just saw the grinding montage, um, we did a lot of shit off screen, well, not off screen, it's in the grinding montage, but, um, I kind of like how I did that thing in the last episode where I cleared out the route in between Goldenrod and Ecritique. Like, that was the grinding montage. So I tried to do that for Ecritique to Olivine. Unfortunately, um, I ran into Steven Stone. Didn't realize he was going to be there. This is Sacred Goal, not Heart Goal. Regular Heart Goal, he's not there. But I ran into Steven Stone, and basically all he did, he told us about the plates. You know, to get Arceus. Or Arceus, or however, you pronounce, however the fuck you pronounce it. I am out of breath. God, I'm such a fucking fat ass! <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, we ran to Steven Stone, got the plates from him, he basically told us, they're scattered about the land, and we just have to go find them, and, um, in case you guys didn't know, that's, like, the goal of Sacred Gold, like, that's how you win the game, you have to catch Arceus, in order to do that, you have to have all the Pokemon, all the plates, all that shit, I don't know how I got all the Pokemon already, like, 493 Pokemon in my Pokedex, don't ask me, maybe it's just easy mode, so we can get to Arceus sooner, I don't know, but either way, we ran to Steven Stone, told us about the plates, um, I didn't go to the Moo Moo farm because in the last episode we had a call from Whitney said her Moo, her Moo tank, her mill tank was there, so I don't know if that's an event or not, we're gonna go see, and, uh, we ran to our rival outside of Olivine Gym, but he was just talking shit, we didn't battle him or anything like that, so I ain't really, you know, that important, um, and the last thing is we went to the, um, dance theater north here in Ecritique and picked up HMO3, which is Surf. And we taught it to our happy feet. But let's go ahead and go over our party real quick from the last episode. As you can see, Razor our Gligger, or Gligger, as I like to say, has evolved into a Gliss score. Um, this motherfucker is a bitch and a half to train, I'm telling you. I did not like training him. But the reason I did that is because he's part flying type, and the next gym that we have to go to is a fighting type gym. So it would be in our best interest to have a Gliss score with the best stats that he could have, somewhat, or for what we're trying to get to, and our goal for training was level 35, I figured we'd be able to handle anything in this episode with a team of 35, so hopefully we can, and Wing Attack, Swords Dance, Night Slash, Cross Poison, I'm happy with him, I've never really used a, a, a Glyph score before, I think he's, I think he's a shit, I think he's a shit, he's a shit, so I don't know, his defense is crazy good, and his attack, he's, he's pretty fucking nice, if I do say so myself, I like him. Uh, up next we have Navi Bear, level 35 as well. He learned Bite. I got rid of... Uh, what the fuck did I get rid of? Razor Wind. Got rid did, did I have Bite in the last episode? I don't remember if I had Bite in the last episode or not. I think I might have when I took on the gym. I don't know. But either way, Bite is the newest move that he learned. Bite, Sucker Punch, Super Power, Swords Dance. I like him. I'm not really sure how I feel about two Pokemon with Swords Dance right now. I know when I did Dark Rising with Callum in the last episode that we did that, Swords Dance kind of saved my life. But that's really the only thing that I have going for me right now. I don't know, maybe since we're doing a lock format, it might come in handy. I don't know, we'll see. Maybe Glisco or Razor can take a couple hits because his defense is so much higher than the rest of his stats. Then he could put up a couple Swords Dances and smash some niggas! I don't know, we'll see. I haven't really used Swords Dance on Nappy Bear yet, so that might be the next move to go. I don't know, we'll see. We shall see. Up next, we have Frisco, level 35 as well. His attack stat is off the fucking charts compared to everything else. Um, he didn't, oh, he learned Thunderfang, I was gonna say he didn't really learn much, um, he learned Thunderfang, I replaced Spark with that, so, I just figured Thunderfang being a physical move would work better than Spark being special, so, yeah, 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 yeah. Then we have Happy Feet, our Prinplup, I thought about leveling up just one more level just to get the evolution, but, fuck it, we'll get it this episode, hopefully at least we'll get it. Taught him Surf, uh, Hidden Power, Hydro Pump, and Yaw, 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 Yawn! I taught him Surf, he already knew the rest of them, so yeah. And then last but not least, we have our little buddy Onslaught down here. Um, he's just doing what he does. <laughs> I didn't really feel like leveling him up right now because I don't I don't see me like really using him in this episode. Maybe he's just gonna continue having the sweet life, holding the experience here, getting leveled up a little bit. 
and uh, hopefully by the time he evolves at least we might be able to use him then but still he's only level 26 while everyone else is level 35 so really we have four Pokemon on our team right now and uh, Onslaught's just chilling getting his leveling up getting his training on because I really don't want to do any training with a dragon type Pokemon, like grinding montage type training, because that's going to take forever, because dragons take forever to level up. But either way, let's check up on our PC. Um, you guys mentioned in the last episode that uh, we went to the archae archaeological, shit, I can't talk, archaeological um, bike place, whatever, in Goldenrod. All I did was go outside and walk back in, I could get my fossils. Well, motherfuckers, I'm sure y'all saw that in the grinding montage, but I did that. I did just that, you guys. I did just that. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six motherfuckers right here. And they all count as event Pokemon. That's how we do it, so we can hatch as many eggs as we can. And so we have six Pokemon, all level 20 right here, to swap out. Yeah, all level 20. And then I also went back to Goldenrod and got the cast form from Bill. In regular Gold, Silver, Crystal, Bill gives you an Eevee. In this game, and in Sacred Gold, he gives you a cast form because Cynthia already gave us an Eevee outside of Mr. Pokemon's house. So, he gave us the cast form, and that makes seven Pokemon that we need to swap for eggs right now. I think we're going to go ahead and wait until the end of the episode to do that, just because swapping seven Pokemon is going to take like 30 minutes, yo. Like, that's going to, like, let's, let's get the good shit out the way. Let's go to the gym, kick some fucking ass, and then handle the eggs and all that good shit, right? Because I'm pretty sure once we get to sign, well, we have to get the Shuckle, and then I think there's another event Pokemon there in Sacred Gold for us. So, we'll have to see. So, that makes seven, eight, nine. We might have nine or ten eggs to hatch in this episode. Well, we're going to have more than that because we're going to catch Pokemon on routes as we get there. Shit! So, I don't know. We got a lot of, do a lot of shit to do. I also went and, uh... Leveled up uh, Absol or Shadow or Absol, Lady Mind our routes, our routes, and I got Bone back. That was his name. If you guys remember from last episode, I completely didn't even pay attention to the name of the egg when I hatched it, and uh, his name was Bone back the Houndour, and then uh, Star Fox or Ryalu as well. So I got them all leveled up because we hatched him last episode. And, you know we do leveling off screen and all that shit. I feel like I've been talking for 20 fucking minutes. Holy shit! <sighs> Anyways, uh, yeah, so we got them leveled up. I think uh, if I got another replacement for. Ice Queen, because we lost Ice Queen last episode. <sighs> Spoiler alert. Because um, you saw we only have five Pokemon in our party. I think for a replacement, it's either going to be Star Fox or Bone back here. And the reason I say that is because we have a Fighting type gym next, then a Steel type gym, then an Ice type gym, then a Dragon type gym coming up next. Those are the last four gyms in the region. No shit, isn't that happy? Um, <laughs> fighting type gym we got covered with Razor. He's got his Wink Attack and his Swords Dances. And then. Who's after that? Steel? Steel is... Isn't Steel weak to fighting? I feel like it's another one of those brain fart moments. If, if I'm wrong, I apologize. Don't uh, fucking crucify me in the comment section. But I'm pretty sure Steel is weak to fighting. And of course, it's weak to fire. So that, that's Star Fox and Boneback right there. Um, but then, after that, we have an Ice-type gym. And Ice is weak to fire and fighting. But, in Price's gym, like, half of his Pokemon are Water Ice. So, Boneback's really not going to be much use in there. Cause like all, all it takes is a fucking dugong to you surf and he's gone. <laughs> so with that being said, I think that Star Fox is who I'm going to try and level up next. It'll probably be in the next episode. Like you'll see me leveling him up in the grinding montage and whatnot. Cause I think I'm, I'm just going to go with the team that I have for, for right now for this episode and all that good shit. So finally, we're done with our updates, updating everybody on what's been going on in the party. Um, oh, I, I lied. I'm not done yet. <laughs> Our on deck box is starting to become a little full. Uh, we feared this was going to happen. Uh, this is our alleged death box right now. We've only lost three members of our party so far. Um, someone recommended that I take these Pokemon that I've already swapped out for eggs and just release them. And then reappropriate these eggs in like the other spaces around the boxes. Just so I can have this other box empty right here for whatever. Um, I think after today's episode we might have to do that because we're going to hatch like 10 eggs in today's episode easily. So, I don't know. Either way, let's go ahead and get the fuck out of Ecritique. I love Ecritique. I love it, y'all. I love it. The da 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 ness of the city. I, I love it. Like, I just, it's so fucking peaceful. <laughs> Watch me sink that wrong and it's all off. Anyways, let me stop being creepy and weird. Let's get the fuck out of here. This is not lag BTWs for everyone that's that's not new to the series. They want to say, oh, Nappy, your emulator's lagging. It's not. 
It's a fucking speed up button, so woo fucking saw. I'm gonna try not to use it, but if I do, it ain't lag, bitch! It ain't lag. But alright, so this right here is why I want Razor for the next gym, because he just smashes people, because he is part flying. I always get uh, Gliss score, not Gliger, because I know Gliger uh, enough. Because isn't Gliss score OU in competitive battling? Isn't he OU? Um, Gliger's UU, and I do more UU than OU. I fucking hate OU. But, um,. I always get uh, Gliscor mixed up. I always think he's poison flying. I completely forget that he's still ground. Um, other thing I forgot to mention was right here at these crossroads, I'm sure you saw we ran into Baoba, or the fuck his name is, the guy that runs the Safari Zone. So I'm sure we'll run into him again sometime later. Oh, Giga Drain. Giga Drain. So nice. I'll take the Giga Drain from you. Alright, what the fuck's going on here? Where's putting these milk tank? My milk tank ain't giving me milk no more! This here's farm's got famous milk! If everyone gets a drink, I'll give lots of milk if I need it! Lots of berries, I reckon! Our milk giving goes out to get you! So if our milk tank won't give us any milk, we're in trouble! Alright, well, shit. Where's the where's Whitney's milk tank? Where's Whitney's milk tank? Is this Whitney's milk tank? Moo! It's cry is weak! Give an orange berry to milk tank! You can have an orange berry, bitch. Your cry is still weak? Take another fucking orange berry. Take another fucking orange berry. Take another fucking orange berry. I don't have any more orange berries. What the fuck? You ate all my fucking orange berries, you bitch! <sighs> and you're still weak. <sighs> Whatever. Fuck her. Oh, look at all the cows. Moo. Moo. What up, bitch? Left step, right step, hop twice. No, no, that's not it. Move to the right, move to the right. Yeah, Chris. What the fuck? Transform dance moves. Oh, inspiration, graceful blossom. I know what to do. Well, I don't have a blossom, bitch. You might want to go find one. Might want to go find one. All right, Team 60 Drain Punch. That's nice too. If I, uh, well, I don't know that that Ryalu that we have in the box, Star Fox's move set's fucking sick. It's sick as fuck. But either way, we already clear out this route. Um, if you guys saw, I pulled another mistake over here when I was grinding. I was grinding in this grass on Route 38 and killed our first encounter. Wasn't even paying attention. I was just grinding or whatever. So we shot that one. Um, so we gotta catch one on Route 39 over here in the grass, but another thing that caught my eye over here was this right here, this little rock climb area. Um, I'm pretty sure this was not here in the original Gold Silver Crystal or Heart Gold Soul Silver, so this is something that's been added by Dreano, the, the Sacred Gold Storm Silver guy that made the rum hack, all that shit. But let's see what our first encounter down here is gonna be. We don't have a first encounter, oh shit. What's our first encounter gonna be? Oh, eradicate. Oh, please don't hyperfang, superfang, everybody. Oh, this is gonna suck. Uh, what I wanna do is. Can I. Happy Feet, can you take a hit from whatever he's gonna give you? Ice Fang. Ha! <laughs> Dumb bitch. It's a good thing we did that, too, because that Ice Fang would've destroyed fucking Razor. Fire Fang? You're dumb. Do you know what my typing is? I know I'm part steel, but I'm part water, too, you motherfucker. Let's go. There we go. Alright, Graticate's caught. Level 28. Fuck off. I don't want to give you a goddamn name. You don't deserve it. You're just a fucking ticket. Here's the ticket to swap out. Alright, so we're in Olivine City now. Uh, we can catch another Pokemon here, too. <laughs> we could catch another fucking Pokemon here. It sucks because the Glitter Lighthouse, Lighthouse that's here, I, guess, I wonder if you guys knew that that's what it was called. Called the Glitter Lighthouse. Uh, hey, homeboy, give me the good run. Give me the good run. Um, it sucks that you can't encounter wild Pokemon there, because that's another area that I could catch a uh, Pokemon in, but, oh well, can't catch a Pokemon there. This is Route 40, okay, so I need to catch a Pokemon in Olivine City. I can't fucking hit the water here. <gasps> I can get to the water here. Can I, I can't surf here. Oh, yes, I can. Oh, yes, I can. When there's a wheel, there's a way. Let's catch a motherfucking Pokemon. Let's go. Oh, Tentacool. You're so cute. I only have seven Pokeballs. I need you to get in this. There we go. I was about to say, I only have seven Pokeballs. I need you to stay in the goddamn ball, bruh. Stay up. Oh, no, 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 no. Fuck Tentacruel. Fuck Tentacruel. Tentacruels will fuck you up. All right, so we got that done. Is this a different area, too? No, it's not. Okay. All right. Lucky bitch. Lucky bitch. Actually, hold on. I want to check just to be sure. Nope. Still Olivine City. God damn it. God damn it, Bobby. I wonder what people think of like this gigantic like flying scorpion that's behind me. It's like, oh my god, there's a flying scorpion chasing me! Help me! Help me! Fat man sailor, help me! You're just standing there watching this mother Anyways, so yeah. Um I'm in a good mood today if you guys didn't couldn't tell. This is like a polar opposite of like the mood that I was in the other day when I tried to record this the first time. Complete opposite. 
So yeah, but still, it's it's a flying fucking scorpion. How creepy is that? Somebody asked me before, like on a live stream or some shit like that, like what's the one Pokemon that I wouldn't want to meet in real life? And I said like Spirit Tomb or some shit. That was the first thing that came to mind. But now that I think about it, this motherfucker right here is who I would not want to meet. Either him or Galvantula or some shit like that. I do not want to meet a flying scorpion. I don't like regular scorpions that are just on the ground. Like fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck scorpions, let alone give him fucking wings. Get the fuck out of here, dude. But either way, he's a fucking monster in battle, so I'm cool with it. You know, it's whatever, yo. It's whatever, yo. But alright, so, um, what's your name's not at the gym? So we need to... What's this? What's this? Was this here originally? I think it was. Um, what's your name? Uh, Jasmine's not at the gym. She's actually the top of the lighthouse taking care of her Amphiros. I like the buzz for a Skarmory. You crazy. Uh... Seal tight. Oh, metal coat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, she's not in her gym. She's up top in the lighthouse taking care of Amphi, the Ampharos, the lighthouse Pokemon. So we gotta go up there and snatch her dumb ass back down here so he can fuck a whip her ass in the gym. Um, that metal coat reminded me that when I met Steven, he actually gave me the iron plate. First of the plates out of the, what is it, 16 plates? 17 plates? It's 17 with fairy type, I think it is. So 16 plates, lighthouse. No new Pokemon I can catch. But yeah, he gave me the iron plate. Who's this? Oh, it's Volkner. Okay. Glitter Lighthouse. It reminds me a lot of Sunny Shore City. I think that was the voice I gave him in Platinum. I don't remember. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. I'm that guy. But so five with a suck bow tie. Oh, hi. You must be a trainer from Johto, huh? There's something about you. You remind me of a trainer who once recharged my passion for battling. 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 Recharge my passion for battling. Battling like it's got one T. <laughs> It's a shame you aren't challenging the Sinnoh League, and yet you somehow cheered me up. Let me give you a gift as thanks. Oh, thanks, Lopner. Thanks, bruh. Thanks, bruh. Thunder Wave is a simple move that will paralyze whatever it can make contact with. I should probably be off. It was a pleasure to meet you. I feel like his voice is a little, like, that's a fat man's voice. That's not, like, Boltner's voice. Boltner's, like, a skinny young, like, is he a teenager? I don't know if he's a teenager or not, but that voice didn't fit him. Either way, so we need to get through this fucking lighthouse. Ah, shit! Pilot stepped up on the scene, so it'll never be the same. Somebody get the move to the hum about to change the game. Nappy boy up in this bitch, so remember the name. And if I was champion, then you would never beat the game. See, you like to run your mouth, but you weaker than Kelly. Yo, I'm all run through your team and leave you mad at the Gyarados. I got you coughing and wheezing. With your games, y'all cheating, but you can keep on believing that winning is within reason. If this was IRL, I got a team of gang guards. Keep a lit with me like I'm afraid of the dark. I'm a seasoned veteran. I put Put in work, generation one, I got all my shirt. So prepare for trouble and make it double. Smash some rare candies and get on my level. But you need to back up before you feel my poly wrath. You can call me show food, cause I leave them in body bags. I can pull them a champ and hit you with that flex. How much is left after that cuddle of death? I don't mean to name drop, that's just who I respect. And everybody else can suck my big lip I can pull the Pokedex out and spit straight balls Slow, sicker than muck and hotter than magma I ain't going nowhere, so you need to realize Cause my bag is filled with nothing but revive <laughs> Alright, so we made it up here to this little fucking hiding place of this bitch I'm sorry Jasmine, I don't even know you and I just called you a bitch, I'm sorry Anyways, we made it up here to Jasmine and uh, the sick little Amphi Amphi, Amphi, Amphi this Pokemon always kept the sea lit at night, but it suddenly got sick. It's gasping for air. I understand that there is safe, wonderful pharmacy in Cyanwood City. She didn't even say city, I'm just giving her a lisp. <laughs> but that's across the sea, and I can't leave empty, behind or unattended. May I ask you to get some medicine for me, please? Alright, girl, I'll go get you some medicine. I'll go get you some medicine! You sure this super potion won't work? That's right outside your little glass dome, your little glass enclosure. Alright, so we got through there, as you guys did see in the little uh, montage thing, because I, I sped all that shit up, because that was a lot of just unnecessary battling. I mean, it was good for XP, but 
Um, I sped it all up. You guys saw that our beautiful, lovely Empoleon has happened. Our Happy Feet has evolved into Empoleon, or Primplup into Empoleon. Um, that special attack, though. Um, uh, we found a rare candy at the top of the tower when we dropped down. And in Platinum, I would normally just ignore those, but I figured that, hey, since I got it right there, and you guys saw me use it right there, then it's, it's okay, I guess. But, either way. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, we got Empoleon. Good to go. And now we need to get to Cyan Wood City. Shan Wood City! Um, I forgot to mention the beginning of the episode because we were talking about all the different updates and shit. But in the last episode, you guys, we... What do you want? Hey, Great Waves here. No one can... Okay, whatever. We, um... What is this? Battle Frontier head. I think we might... We might do the Battle Frontier this time. When I did Soul Silver, I didn't fuck with the Battle Frontier. And then when I did Platinum, I didn't fuck with the Battle Frontier because we lost our Platinum Analog. But still, <laughs> too soon to bring up. But I think I might do that. I might live stream that towards the end. If I own... I don't have a if I own, yo. I don't have it. I think I am going to lead with um, Frisco, though, since we're going into water. But, in the last episode, uh, I mentioned that our light goal was a thousand likes in the video, and you guys smashed it! You fucking smashed it! I was, I was so fucking happy, I was so ecstatic to see that, that we were able to do that. Um, and, I don't, I don't know, like, I was, I don't know, it was, it was just, it's a good feeling, yo, it's a good feeling to know that all this hard work and effort um, it's it's appreciated. So thank you guys for that. Thank you so much for that. Thank you. Thank you. That's all, that's all I wanted to say. I just want to say thank you. <laughs> Brings a tear to my eye. Thank you. Cause like I was talking about earlier, like I have a certain standard uh, of quality in my videos, and I don't want to bring you guys shit content. You know, so I'm I'm happy that it, that the the hard work and all the content itself is just appreciated. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. From the bottom of my African American heart. Thank you. I hate that term African American. Cause it's like. It's like, if, if you're Mexican-American, doesn't that describe, like, like, traditionally in the sense of, like, blank American, doesn't that describe, like, where you came from? Like, if you're Mexican-American, you were, you were born in Mexico, and then you traveled to America, immigrated to America, right? I, th I thought that's what it was. If it's not, then I apologize. But to me, that's, like, that's always been weird, like, saying African-American. Like, I'm not from Africa. I was born in America. I'm American. You know, you can call me black if you want to. Like, I, I don't I don't have a problem with that. Just African Americans just like eh, eh, eh. Alright, CM88 pluck. Pluck, 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 pluck. You think it would make sense to like have let us fly to Cyanwood? Instead of like going across all this shit? Cause don't you need like the the Cyanwood gym badge in order to like do fly? Cause doesn't Chuck's husband Chuck's husband, wow. Chuck and Larry doesn't. <laughs> uh, what's her name? What's what's his fucking name? Doesn't uh, Chuck's wife give you fly afterwards? We're gonna use the super bow we found in the tower. Let's get the fuck out of here! Damn it, bitch! I was trying to get past you. I'll probably go back through here and fight all these trainers in like the next grinding montage or some shit. I just don't want to fight them all right now. Like goddamn, I'd be here for an hour and a half fighting all these motherfucking people. All these motherfucking people. And did you guys know that these grinding montages that I do, like the little four minute one that we had before this episode? Oh, it's got its fucking ice charge, or ice charge, whatever lightning rod ability on. Fuck you. Um, like the, four little, the little four minute grinding montage, that's like an hour and 20 minutes worth of grinding compressed all the way down. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Did we run into a wild Pokemon up here? Did we? I don't remember. I have a super repel on right now, though. I don't remember if we ran into a Pokemon on Route 40 or not. I know we did on Route 41, and I don't have... Well, I have a Super Repel on right now, so I can't even, like, check. This bitch fucking turned around! Are you kidding me? So, we might have to come back afterwards and hit up Route 40 and Route 41. And if, 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 if I did, in fact... um, Here, this is what I'll do, this is what I'll do. I'll catch a Pokemon on Route 40. And then afterwards, if I already ran into a Pokemon on Route 40, uh, I'll just release it. Like, I won't hatch that egg yet. You know what I'm saying? Does that make sense? Like, I won't hatch the egg right now in this episode. I don't know. By the way, we are now in Cyanwood City, and I think... Oh, I still have fucking Repel on! Shit! Ah, shit! We still have Repel on, so I can't even, like, catch a Pokemon over here. There we go. Repel's effect wore off. Let's get the fuck over here and catch another goddamn Pokemon. Because if we go back out and surf right there, that's Route 44, 41 still. But right here, area didn't change. And our sign was City Pokemon Catch is a Pelipper. How you doing there, Mr. Pelipper? 
I think I wanna put your dumb ass to sleep. Bitch! Cause I'll be balling, I'm balling, I'm balling like a bitch. Yeah, I'm balling, I'm balling, I'm balling like a bitch. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, motherfucker. Go to sleep. Uh, can I hit you with a surf and would you survive it? That's the question. Mm. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna risk it. I got 10 Pokeballs. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna risk it. There you go. Pelipper was caught. No nickname for you, bitch. No nickname for you, bitch. Okay, so that's the second time in this one recording that I've been fucking interrupted. First time was because fucking family came in, started bitching, yada 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 about some dumb shit, and then just now I had a fucking Windows update, and my computer shut down in the middle of the fucking recording. Like, can you believe that? Like, insta rage, insta rage. Everything that I've done so far in this episode, I had to go back and redo. I had to redo all of it. <sighs> Either way, we're back here now. We are back here now, and um, we caught our Route 40 and Route 41 Pokemans. Uh, let's see who's in my party now. This was the Route 40 encounter. Um, I don't think, well, well, I was going to say it doesn't matter because I had to reach my computer, but still, it's it's part of the recording. If I already caught a Pokemon on Route 40, I won't hatch this, I won't hatch a Pokemon for this tentacle right now. And in the next episode, I'll hatch this tentacle. If, if in fact, this is the first encounter, then I'll hatch this tentacle in the next episode. But then this is my Route 41 capture. So we have a total of 12 Pokemon so far to fucking... 12 eggs to hatch in this episode right now. And this dumbass is right next to the fucking PC! Move, bitch! Move, bitch. This guy looks like he's important. What are you gonna say, bruh? Hoo-ah! Through singular discipline, we will reign supreme! Hoo-ah! We will be strong! Hoo-ah! We will prevail! Hoo-ah! There's a nifty little item I like for you if you have your choice, man. You like it when I watch you, buddy? You and your little meta type there? Yeah, you sick freak. Alright, so, he gave us choice bam. Fuck choice bam, I'm not using choice bam right now. So, we're in Sinewood City, we need to get the medicine, and we need to uh, get these event Pokemon that are here. If I remember correctly, this is the Shuckle House, right? It's either this one or the one that's way down there. I've, I swear it's the one that's way down there. Maybe it's not. I don't know. I, I'm in shock. A guy about your age came with piercing eyes and long hair. He scared me into giving him my prize Pokemon. I still have one left, but what if he comes back? You look strong. You selected my Pokemon for... Yeah. This is the Shuckle House. Okay. Good, 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 good. That's like a little pet peeve of gaming when like I have to find a certain house in like a city with like 1,600 fucking houses and I can't find the fucking house. <sighs> what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Alright, so let's, uh, let's drop off the shuckle here. Shucky ducky quack quack! Shuckle, 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 shuckle. He's got berry juice. Alright, so we drop him off, so that makes number 13. <laughs> 13th egg for us to hatch today's episode. Alright, so now, if I remember correctly, when I was glancing through the little readme that came with the Storm Silver Heart Gold pack and all that shit, uh, ooh, Suicune, Suicune, Suicune's up in this motherfucker, let's do it. What's up, Suicune? How you doing, girl? How you doing, girl? How you doing, girl? What up, girl? Got a little keychain on your forehead there. <laughs> Scryfty! Yo, Nappy, wasn't that Suicune just now? Oh my god, I only caught a quick glimpse, but I saw, I thought I saw, I thought I saw a booty cat. I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune is beautiful and grand. And it races through towns and roads at simply awesome speed. It's wonderful. It's fabulous! Wow. Okay, I gotta stop that. <laughs> Scrafty, I want to see Suicune up close. I decided I'll better use the trainer to earn Suicune's respect. Come on, Nappy. Let's battle now. Wow. Okay, so you seen or you sign? Mystery Man, you sign. I'm gonna call him you sign. What's the battle? Okay, alright, 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 alright. Night Slash. What am I doing? I'm sitting here thinking, what moves can I possibly use? I'll fuck your nasty plot and the click it fucking claims. Go to hell. Psychic. Oh, you can take the hit. Even with a nasty plot, you can take the hit, Razor. You can take the hit, Razor. 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 Thank you, Razor. My god, thank you, Razor. My god, thank you, Razor. If I lost Razor in this fight right before we get to the fucking gym, I'm gonna be so many different types of pissed. Rotom. Uh, Ghost, Dark, uh, let's go for our other Dark type Pokemon. Let's go out to him. Other Dark type Pokemon. Because I got another one, right? Well, I do have another one. I have uh, Nappy Bear, but, but Razor's not Dark type, so. Alright, so who's next? Who's next? Onslaught's level 30. Look at that motherfucker. Electrode. Um, let's keep battling. We're just gonna see what he does. Let's go for, let's go for a Night Slash. 
Oh, get fucking destroyed! Oh, get fucking destroyed. I was hoping he wasn't gonna go for self-destruct. That would really fucking suck. Really suck. Jump off. Fire Fang! Fire for Fire Fang! I always I always get Fire Fang like like the song Fire Flame by Birdman, Lil Wayne. Fire Flame, Fire for Fire Flame. Spears. And no, I don't like Birdman. I'm not a huge fan of Lil Wayne. I just like the beat on that song. You can't lie, the beat on that song goes fucking hard. Either way, it's whatever. <gasps> Onslaught's evolving! Oh my god, Onslaught's evolving! Oh, my baby boy! My baby boy! He's growing up! He's not a baby no more! He's a pimply faced teenager! Look at the pimples on your face! Take your hoodie off, boy! Can't wear that hoodie in class! Anyways, alright. Onslaught evolving shot. You want to learn protect. Um, I like your moveset the way it is, bro. I think I think we'll be good without protect. Scrafty, you're just simply amazing, Navi. I'm starting to understand why Sweet Coon was keeping an eye on you. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna keep searching for Sweet Coon. I have a feeling we'll see each other again. Oh, see you around. Get out of here, bitch. Fuck out my face, motherfucker. Oh, event right here. Is this the chick? Oh, hello. A Pikachu was washed up on the shore. It seems it was surfing but collapsed. It could do with a kind trainer to take care of it. Oh, are you a trainer? That Pokemon leading your party. It's very happy, isn't it? Perhaps, would you be willing to take care of this Pikachu? Pikachu. It's a Pikachu. Excellent. I'm very glad to hear it. Here you go. Got a Pikachu, nigga. Ah, oh, yeah. Got a Pikachu, nigga. Ah, oh, yeah. Got a Pikachu. Thank you. Do you know the Battle Frontier? Yeah, bitch, I passed it. We may meet again if you visit the Battle Castle. A battle? No. I cannot do that. I'm sorry. Thank you again. Alright, so we got Pikachu! And let's see what level 26 not He knows fly! What? I knew I'd see see like I said, I read the little readme and it was a surfing Pikachu event, cause like I read the readme to make sure that I get everything in the next episode where we go. And they said you get a Pikachu. It was it said you get surfing Pikachu, but damn, motherfucker knows fly. Are you kidding me? His moveset is fucking tits. Surf fly, wish, and thunderbolt? My god, why do I have to give this Pikachu up? Oh, it's fucking tits. I don't really know why Pikachu knows Fly, but still. Well, let me rephrase that. I don't think Fly would be the world's greatest move on Pikachu, but still, that's an interesting moveset. That's a nice moveset, if I do say so myself. If I do say so myself. I feel like that's a moveset that Gyarados could legitimately have if he was a legitimate flying type Pokemon. Because, you know, a lot of you guys, a lot of people don't know that Gyarados can learn Thunderbolt and Flamethrower. So, yeah. Yeah, the more you know. The more you know. But I'm pretty sure that that's all the event Pokemon that we need for right now in this city. Let's go ahead and drop a little motherfucker off right here. God, we have so many Pokemon to hatch. 6, 10, 14. We have 14 fucking eggs to hatch at the end of this episode. I could go to the Safari Zone, the route going towards the Safari Zone and catch a Pokemon there, too. I think we'll save that for the next episode, though. But, alright. So, we need to... Um, what's, what's, my, what's my health situation looking like here? Nine Super Potions and a Hyper Potion. I don't really need that revive. I don't know where I got that revive from. I probably found it somewhere. Oh, my God. This is Chuck's wife right here. She gives you fly. That I remember from Soul Silver. Because you gotta go to her to get his fucking phone number for the gym leader rematch. Oh, I'm nervous about this gym. I'm nervous about this gym. I'm nervous about this gym. I'm really nervous about this gym because I remember from Soul Silver. See, I remember a lot of shit from, from Soul Silver. I remember a lot of stupid shit from Soul Silver. Um, in Soul Silver, when I fought Bruno, and if you guys saw the Let's Play, or if you go back and watch the Let's Play, then you'll you'll know what I'm talking about because you'll see it. Um, Bruno has a Hitmontop. And I know that any Pokemon can learn counter, but like Hitmontop is notorious. Like every time you face an NPC character in the game with um or AI, whatever you want to call it, um, in the game that has Hitmontop, nine times out of ten they have counter. Like other Pokemon, other fighting type Pokemon, maybe not, but nine times out of ten, Hitmontop has counter. Don't ask me why. Game freak, why did you do that? But um, I'm really fucking afraid because I might try to go for some other move and weaken him first. Because it seems like every single time I go for like a wing attack or a flying type move, he holds on with like 1 HP. Like, is that a part of counter? Like, I don't know if that's a part of counter. Like, you're supposed to hold on with 1 HP and then just counter and reverse all that shit? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how counter works. I just know that it fucking destroys me. And I really, I would be really, really upset if I wing attack and hit him on top in this gym and he counters on my razor. That would really fucking suck. 
<clears throat> really fucking sick. But I'm trying to think of what Chuck's team could be because in this ROM hack, all the gym leaders have a full team of six. And I know we've seen. I hope he doesn't have an Infernape. That would really fucking suck. Or a Blaziken. That sucks. I know he's gonna have Poliwrath because that's his ace from before. He had a Poliwrath and. Didn't he have like a Poliwrath and, and a Primate in one version? And then he had like a Poliwrath and a Machoke in another or some shit like that? But, so I know he's gonna have a Poliwrath, a Primate. Uh, I. He might have a Machoke. I don't see him having a Machamp. He might have a Machamp. Uh, we did see a Ryalu, so I hope he doesn't have Lucario. I hope he doesn't have an Infernape or Blaziken either. Oh, it really fucking suck. Oh, it really fucking suck! Ah, oh, shit! Go for a fake out? What the fuck's wrong with you, bitch? Get smashed. Get smashed, get smashed, get smashed. What's my health looking like? Oh, nope, nope, not right here. What's my health looking like? 108 out of 111. I don't, I don't know why I had the feeling I need to heal right there. Alright, one trainer left, and then, uh, oh, I don't even have to fight his dumbass. I don't even have to fight his dumbass, but you know me! I want to get all the training that I can, so I am going to fight his dumbass. I don't think I'm going to need to heal either, because I got plenty of wing attacks. I got plenty of fucking wing attacks. So, alright. Come on, bruh. Come on, bruh. What you got for me? What you got for me? Last training in the goddamn gym, and then we can go fight homeboy. And then we can go have some fucking eggs! Go have some- Oh, I forgot all about Hitmonlee and Hitmonchan! What if he has a Hitmonlee and a Hitmonchan, too? That'd be some crazy shit right there. Hitmonchan. Oh, he's got a Hitmonchan right here. I'm talking about Chuck. What if Chuck has a Hitmonlee and a Hitmonchan? Vacuum wave? Motherfucker, are you crazy? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Get fucking smashed. <gasps> him on top. 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 Who do I send out for him on top? I don't have to send out here. Happy feet. Um, I'm, I'm like automatically scared. What if he has counter? 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 I'm gonna go for Yon. Go to sleep, bitch. Go to sleep. Oh, he does have counter! Oh, fuck you! Fuck you, bitch! Fuck you! Motherfucker automatically went for counter! You can suck a fat cock and die for all I care! Oh, I hate you! Oh, I hate you with a fucking passion! Fuck off! Oh! 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 I just had a little mini heart attack! Oh! Somebody call the cops! Oh! Why would you call the cops for a heart attack? Oh! Call the fucking 911! I had a mini heart attack! <sighs> JK, not really. Don't actually call the cops. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. But still! Oh my god, that would have pissed me the fuck off. Oh, I hate counter. Alright, you guys. You know the drill. Only you can prevent lost save data. Only you can prevent lost save data. So make sure you save your game at all occasions that you can. And uh, I'm playing on an L emulator. So I'm going to actually go ahead and save state. Boom, like that. Yeah, that doesn't make a difference because I'm playing in that Glock. I say it every single time. But alright, Mr. Chuck. Ha! The pounding waterfall right into my head! Ah! Oh, why'd you stop the waterfall from blowing on me? You just spoiled my training! I have to warn you, I'm a strong trainer training every day under this waterfall! What? It has nothing to do with Pokemon! Oh shit, that's true! Oh shit, come on, I'll fuck you up! I feel like that's Chuck. Chuck's just a crazy fucking kick ass. Ah! Look at him! Either Chuck. Primeape! Okay, so he gets the one down down the bat right there. Hold this wing attack for me, bitch! Hold the wing attack! Hold the wing attack! Hold up! He leads with level 34, so his ace might be like 38-ish. Rock slide. <gasps> Are you kidding me right now? Razor, razor! There you go! Uh, for some reason I thought his his flying type and he was just gonna get fucking destroyed there. <sighs> the dual typings. The dual typings, people, the dual typings. Alright, Primate, just fucking lay down and die. Shit. I don't wanna have to waste all this fucking shit on you. Actually, no, I'm gonna go for sword dance. Because Rock Slide's not going to do shit to me. Even if it crits, it shouldn't do shit to me. There you go. I'm going to go for another one. I might go for three. Because he's just going to spam Rock Slide over and over again. Alright, hit me with the Rock Slide. And then I'm going to go for the heal. So we got three Swords Dances up. Stop it! Asshole! Asshole! So we got three Swords Dances up with Wing Attack and a Fighting Type Gym. We should smash anything that he gives us. We should absolutely annihilate anything that he puts in front of us. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We shall see. And didn't I start this episode off talking about how Swords Dance, I never use it, and then I used it in Dark Rise and now I fucking love it? Onslaught wants to learn Dragon Breath. You can, by God, you can learn some motherfucking Dragon Breath. Um, It doesn't really make a difference because Salamence's attack and special attack, he's got a high attack and special attack and speed. But the question is, what would I get rid of for it? I don't think... Uh, well, Fire Fang would be nice in the next gym, just in case anything happens. You know, I still have... Pokemon knows it. Bite's nice. Dragon Rush is nice, but its accuracy is low as fuck. 
I think I'm gonna get rid of Dragon Rush. The reason I say that is because I like Bite, I like having a Dark type move on him. Because eventually I'm gonna replace Bite with Crunch. Because I'm pretty sure he learns Crunch. I think he learns Crunch. Fire Fang's nice to have just for like a variety of moves, and Hydro Pump is always a nice thing to have. And like I said, it doesn't matter because he's got a high attack and special attack. So, I don't know. I kinda wanna get rid of Dragon Rush for Dragon Breath. How much damage does Dragon Rush do? 100. How much does Dragon Breath do? Dragon Breath has a chance to paralyze them. I think I'm gonna get rid of Bite for now because if he does, if he does learn Crunch, then I can. I was, I was planning on replacing Bite with Crunch anyway. Oh yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get rid of Bite for now, for now. And if he learns Crunch, then we'll be good. If he doesn't, then I'm gonna be fucking pissed. All right, so here comes this Polar Wrath. Is this gonna be your Ace level 35? No, I can't be your Ace because the primate that you led with was higher than this Polar Wrath. So that can't be your fucking Ace, even though that was his Ace in original second gen. Polar Wrath was his fucking Ace. Oh, I'm sad to see a Poirath go down. I like Poirath. All right, so two down, four to go. Razor wants to learn U-turn. Ooh, ooh, U-turn would be nice, but I don't know if I want to give up any of these moves. I like my moves at the way it is now. Sorry, bruh. Sorry, bruh. Sorry, bruh. Sorry, bruh. Plus I had the TM for U-turn, so we're good there. Hit Chan. Oh, please no ice punch. Please no ice punch. Please no ice punch. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I get, I get. No ice punch from your dumbass. Sit the fuck down. Sit the fuck, sit, sit the fuck, sit, sit the fuck right down. All right, so we smashed him. What you got next, bruh? Breloom, ooh. Breloom, I didn't even think about Breloom. Well, you can hold this wing attack, too. <laughs> you can hold this wing attack, too. So it was Primeape his ace? What was Primeape, level 35? Something around there? I haven't seen anything, because I know Polyrath wasn't higher than Primeape. Hitmon Lee. What do they have, Ice Kick? They don't have an Ice Kick move. So what the fuck are you gonna use on me? Mock kick, fake out. What a bitch! Oh my god, I hate priority moves! I absolutely hate priority moves, dude. I fucking despise them. I despise them with a fucking passion. My god, I hate priority moves. Really, really do hate priority moves. Hariyama! And Hariyama, is this your ace? 33, no. So Primate was his fucking ace. We don't know shit! Yeah, you about to lose, bruh. 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 Yeah, so that's fucking sick. I'm so happy I got Razor. I'm so happy I got Razor. Motherfucker won the gym for me. We lost. Oh, oh, I lost. How about that? You were right. You were the up Storm Badge. Yeah, give me the fucking Storm Badge, you bitch. Give me that Storm Badge, you bitch. You bigoty bitch. Storm Badge lets your Pokemon fly to any city or town you've already been to. Here, take this, dude. TM01, what is that? Dynamic Punch? Is it Dynamic Punch or Dizzy Punch? Dizzy Punch, no. Focus Punch, shit! I'm all types of wrong. It doesn't land if the foe you're attacking hits you first, but it's very powerful if it manages to hit. I bet you make a great training partner here, take my number. You use cell phones, Chuck? I figured you just went outside and just yelled and hoped somebody heard you. Alright, fuck off. Fuck off. I got my game badge. Did all the other shit, and here you go, here's your wife. You want you wanna give me your number two? I dick you down. Oh, that's sign what's gym badge! You should take this HM! HMO2. Yeah, that's fly. And somebody told me that in this game, um, in this ROM hack, uh, Gliscor can learn fly. Lyra. What the fuck's Lyra want? Hello! This is Lyra! How are you? If you're going to try it, well, you should try taking a Krabby with you! What's it like? Well, you should try it and see for yourself! What's the fucking point in taking a Krabby with me? Like, I feel like I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to look that up afterwards. Like, is there like a special event going on in here in this ROM hack that a crappy is needed for? I don't know. But either ways, um, so a lot of you guys leave in comments saying that Gliscor can learn fly in this ROM hack. So I'm gonna try it out right now and see. Um, because if he can, that would be really fucking nice to teach him. I really don't want to get rid of anything that he has. So if I did get rid of something, I get rid of Wing Attack. Um, that's a Pokeball. <laughs> I get rid of fucking Wing Attack. Uh, let's see here. Where is it at? Where is it at? We're still in... There it is. We're still in fucking TMs here. Alright. Oh, he cannot! So somebody lied to me! Whoever left that comment, I don't remember the fucking username, you guys said that I could use... I could teach Razor fucking Fly, but he can't. So I just have to wait until Onslaught evolves, and then teach it to... Uh, what should we call it? Salamence. Salamence, Salamence, Salamence. But alright, so now we got our badge. We got all the important shit out of the way for this episode. We need to hatch these Pokemans that we have here. 
Oh my god, we have so many. <laughs> we have so many. We have so many fucking Pokemon to hatch right now. Okay. So Tentacool, level 30. That's what we need to hatch. If none of the if the levels don't match up, like I think I caught a uh, level 28, like I think this Pelipper was the only one that matched up because I caught him at Cyanwood City, and when I caught this Raticate in what you call it, um, the fuck was it? What the fuck was it? What the fuck was it? When I caught this Raticate in um, Route 40, I think whatever the one going to Olivine City was, I think it was level 27 or some shit like that. So that's why it's all fucked up. Cause like I said, I got interrupted twice and the shit reset on me. Cause the computer reset, but all right. So we need to uh, let's hatch some Pokemans. Let's actually let's do let's do this now. Let's do some fucking maintenance now. This guy, uh, we're gonna have to release you, buddy. I'm sorry. I've never I don't normally release Pokemon. My God, that's kind of awkward. Let's release you to get rid of Bye Bye Corpfish. Like I said, we're just I gotta keep the Mudkip. I gotta keep Mudkip. I'll keep Togepi too. I hate to get rid of that Spiritomb. That's like blasphemous. God, no, I'm not gonna get rid of him. Oh, I might get rid of him. I don't know. But um, I'm releasing these guys right now so we have room for these eggs that we have to move out of this box. Uh, let's see here. What eggs? How many eggs do we have here? We have six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have. We made one space. Cool. <laughs> we made one space. Uh, I can't get rid of any of the starter Pokemon that we got from the quiz people in the Pokemon Center because. When you do the quizzes, you get one of the three starters there. But if you take them to the respective champions or whatever, and like, like I know, uh, Oak is in um, somewhere in Kanto, and you show him like Charmander or in this case Squirtle, because we got him, he's right there. He'll give us Charmander and Bulbasaur. Same with Steven in third gen, and same with um, Cynthia in fourth gen, and then who is second gen? Is it Elm? Oh, no, we can't get any more. We can't get any of them in second gen. You should only get one starter in second gen. Duh. Duh, because we're playing a second gen game. Alright, so we need to clear out some space here. Let's clear out these fucking Pokemans. Get these dickheads out of here and move them eggs around. This is probably something that I should do off screen. But I feel like. You know what? That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do it off screen. Let's just hatch a fucking egg. Let's just hatch a fucking egg now. Level 30 tentacle for this guy. Let's pull him. He has a water stone. His name is Hulk, and he has a water stone. All right. So who could Hulk with a water stone be? My guess is a. We're gonna get a Poliwag, and we're gonna have to evolve it into a Poliwrath. So let's bag the water stone and hatch Hulk. Hulk is a level 30 ten cool that we we just dropped off for him. So I have to make notes because I'm like I like like before. I'm not gonna hatch all these motherfuckers on screen right now. Stop my mind from clouding, I'm afraid to switch a place It's like I'm stuck in cruise control and everyone's trying to get past me While I'm too stubborn in my way, screw it, they can drive around me Think my problem is I become too comfortable A likeable, I lose my drive and rock bottom, I have to pull myself back up out of this hole Hope is though important, you know that I'm only human But you hand me the rope, I'm not alone Life likes to throw us these curveballs, that's not what I want I want control, I'm at the top, looking down on myself, hoping I don't fly It's happening a lot, I lose myself and forget that I'm here to leave, yeah let me support, believe it's all I need, so I think sometimes This life is not what you expect it to be You gotta play your cards right I still don't have all that I want. The sinful madness have caused this battle. Cool to tie to my full matter. These daggers are sorrow. Rip through all I got. I spent all these sleepless nights. But give up. Hell no, I shall not. 
Wish the moon would come as just a week as how have I overcome in the past? Well, you help me beat them down. I'm in my fears, you give me power to save myself from drowning. Now the sound of wise me keeps me grounded. A soldier isn't bound. They seem to do well with the gimmicky raps. But I bring true music that speaks to the heart and lyrics they lack. I focus on my message, the essence you're giving me. That surround myself with friends, not those who just feed off digits, relax. A wicked relapse, I'm out turned receptive vision to crap. No pivoting back, but I won't give in, got no business with that. I sit in this trap, constantly plotting my vicious attacks. Refuse to join the ride, enjoy my mission. Musician, it snaps, so come on. Sometimes this life is not what you expect it to be. To think after all that's happened Recall my passion, my past is recapping Balance was absent, I was captive Found my rapping, provided something I haven't felt Abided to rules of retraction And rose from the ashes After all that I still lose control and self-esteem And I feel like home and devices Converge on my soul just to feed Fears are the throne and me exposing grief Opposing teams, composing schemes To overthrow my deeds I reap what I sow, that's what I deem So what happens when I sow negativity And doubt myself, gotta intervene And shout my wealth, cause I'm rich with dreams I stride in hell, but it brings to me No bounce, I yell till it seems to to mount my hill with the kings and queens all rhymes so full when we take that leap and pounce it all seems simple when you see from outside the box i am legend it's time to kindle your speakers got the game unlocked the world is up in flames and i will never be forgotten now so welcome me home cause i'm here to claim my crown and so i think sometimes this life is not what you expect it to be Yes, I'm back to kill it. I got 16 bars and a flow that's so damn fluid. This is Pokey Rap 2. It's time to start a new game. So make sure you say nappy when you choose your rival's name. Antagonistically appropriate, you know I rap Team Rocket. Giovanni is the past and I'm the future and you love it. So out with the old, hang in with the new. Say goodbye to Rattatus, bitch, we starting with that shoe. Go ahead and laugh now, just wait till they evolve. Mahogany and silver written off as a law. This time we're here to stay and we ain't blasting off again. I love being the bad guy so you don't have to pretend. A team rocket executive, so allow me to be blunt But how can you stop me when you can't even be the front? World domination's on my list of things to do But first I gotta get my hands on ashes, Pikachu ah! Okay, so we hatched all of the eggs that we needed to. We hatched a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 eggs just now. 14 of these motherfuckers. Um, some of you guys have been messaging me um, saying that you've been having some issues with the quick egg hatch code not working. Or some shit like that, like it's still taking a super long time to hatch the eggs. I only encountered that once or twice, maybe three times just now. Like, I know uh, Hulk the Poliwag took a really fucking long time to hatch. Um, I think Godzilla took a little while, and maybe, um, Growlithe here, which is supposed to be nicknamed Simba, I completely forgot to nickname him. Um, but still, uh, I only encountered that with a couple of them, a lot of them still hatch relatively quickly, or just after one or two steps, so, I don't know what's happening, I don't know what the issue is. Um, either way, it still takes a lot less time than it normally would. Uh, like I said, really just, Hulk was the only one that I had an issue with, everybody else still hatched relatively quickly. So I don't know what to tell you. Um, if I find out anything more about it, then I'll be I'll make sure to share with you guys. If you guys are watching, you know anything about it? If you know why it might have stopped working or how to fix it, let me know. Um, I tweeted about it, and some people were saying just uh, remove the code, enter it again, or just restart your emulator. I did all that shit, so please don't suggest that. I've already done it. So yeah, I don't know um, what to say to help you fix it. So uh, if it's happening for you for every single egg. 
I, I feel sorry, but like I said, I don't know what to tell you. Anyways, let's go ahead and take a look at the Pokemon that we hatched from these eggs. We have Hulk, the Poliwag, Bubble Beam, Ice Tail, Mudshot, Refresh. Not bad, not bad, not bad. He's got a Water Stone, of course, so I could evolve him into a Poliwrath as opposed to um, a Politoed. So that'd be nice. He's definitely a major replacement for Happy Feet if we do lose him. Uh, next, we have Simba, the Growlithe, which I'm guessing is supposed to be a reference to Mufasa. Uh, from Platinum, or it could just both be references to Lion King, you know? <laughs> I don't know if whoever sent this uh, Growlithe intentionally named him Simba because we had a Growlithe in Platinum named Mufasa, or if it, they just both coincidentally happen to be Lion King references. By the way, Bite, Roar, Heat Wave, Flare, Blitz, fucking love that move set. That's amazing. That's fucking amazing. I love him. Um, he's definitely, I don't know, I, I have the, the Hound Hour and the Growlithe now. I'm leaning a little more towards the Growlithe just because of Flare Blitz, but then again, you know, you can get a lot of recoil from Flare Blitz, so I don't know. We'll see. Next, we have Bless You, the Sneasel. <laughs> get it? Bless You, Sneasel. Anyways, um, you know, Ice Punch, Bite, Crush Claw, and Fake Out. Love that moveset, too. Fucking sick. I might, I might, uh, we already had Sneasel. I have to compare the movesets and see uh, which one I want to carry with me to get into a Weavile, because it's not bad, not a bad. I've been getting a lot of Dark-type Pokemon in this, this uh, egg lock. Y'all yeah, some dark motherfuckers. Next we have Mr. Dicktail, uh, Night Slash, Wing Attack, Cross Poison, Poison Sting. I actually hatched him without taking his item off, the Razor Claw. So I need to um, get that back for him. Need to make a note of that right now, right now, right now, right now, right now, right now. Um, so I gotta get him his Razor Claw. That's like the what the third Gligar we've hatched so far. I don't know. But um, Night Slash, Wing Attack, Cross Poison, Poison Sting. Decent move set. Decent move set. Um, if anything happens to our Razor right now, it's another replacement we have for him, but we'll see. Uh, Bighorn, he's got Pokerus. He has no moves. What the fuck? <laughs> did someone do this intentionally, or did they just fuck up and uh, not enter the moves right, or forget to enter the moves? I don't know. He's got Pokerus, which he didn't get from the party, because he, he wasn't in the party long enough, so they gave him Pokerus, whoever sent Bighorn. And they didn't give him any moves. What the fuck? So, uh, well, he's got to get some rare candies to get himself leveled up to 20. Because I swapped out one of the fossils for him. So he'll learn some moves as he goes. But still, Heracross isn't bad to use. I used Heracross on my Soul Silver and he put in work. So, I don't know, we'll see. Next, we have Taco, the Lotad. Astonish, Water Gun, Razor Leaf, and Giga Drain. Not bad, not bad, not bad. We have Watery Taco in, um... Uh, Platinum. Fucking love that motherfucker right there. He had a, a Water Stone, of course. Um, that was kind of a giveaway when I saw, once I saw the name and the hold item. So, yeah. But still, we have Taco the Low Ted. Uh, Godzilla. Godzilla! We have Godzilla the Larvitar. This is our what? Is this our third Larvitar we've hatched? I don't know. Is that the second or third? I know we have one originally. Dragon Dance, Iron Head, Bite, and Assurance. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. Mr. Krabs. Bubble Beam, Body Slam, and Ancient Power. All right, <laughs> what an awkward move set. I mean, it, they're good moves, it's just not shit that you'd expect on Mr. Krabs. Well, Bubble is, but still, Body Slam, Ancient Power. All right, not mad about that. I love me a motherfucking Crawdon. Again, Dark Type, part Dark Type. Goddamn, how many Dark Types we're gonna get? Then we have Insane, the Ralts holding a Dawnstone. Growl and Shadow Snake is all it knows right now. Um, is the Dawnstone how you evolve a Curlia into a Gallade? I don't know. I've never used a Gallade before. I'm just such a God of Wire fanboy. So I don't know off the top of my head how to get a Gallade. So I have to, might have to look that up. But if it's a Dawnstone, you still got your Dawnstone to hold on to. Then we have another Larvitar. If we didn't have three before, I know this one is definitely the third. This person gave him Poke Rust as well. Drax the Larvitar. The name is sick as fuck. Drax the Larvitar. Like, let's go. Uh, Bite, Dragon Dance, Ancient Power, and Outrage. Holy shit. God damn that moveset. If we had to choose one of the Larvitars, Drax is... The leading uh, competitor right now, my god. Babiri Berry, uh, I'm not sure what that does with Tumhead. I've never even heard of a Babiri Berry, so I have to look up. Well, I was gonna say I have to look it up, but I could just look at what it is right here in the game. Then we have the shiny cricket that we caught. He doesn't count. Star Fox, the Abra. When I saw Star Fox, I was like, did I duplicate the Star Fox egg on accident? But then I remembered, I thought that Star Fox had a space in between Star and Fox. And turns out it was different, but we have this Abra with Ice Punch, Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, and Teleport. My god. Talk about OP. <laughs> but uh, I wouldn't mind using Alakazam. You, know, you don't really get to, well, I don't really get to use Alakazam all that much, so I wouldn't mind using him. I don't know. He's got decent uh, egg moves on him right there, as you hear someone signed to Xbox Live. <laughs> then we have Fight Me! Uh, tackle Foresight, Low Kick. He'll probably end up evolving once I level, start to level him up. He'll have to be leveled up to 20. So, the next episode, after I get everyone leveled up, he'll probably end up being, 
either a Hitmontop, Hitmonchan, or Hitmonlee, so yeah. Then we have Juliet the Nidoran, female of course. I'm guessing that someone sent me a Romeo as well. That might be a male Nidoran, so I'll have to keep an eye out for that. But uh, yeah, Moonstone, Scratch Growl, doesn't know shit yet. <laughs> so well. Then we have Charlie the Pineco. Is it Pineco or Pineco? I, I never knew. I never knew. Um, but he was holding a rare candy. I gave him back his rare candy because uh, I'm assuming that like I'm supposed to use it on him. So I don't want to just keep the rare candy for anybody else. But um, I wouldn't mind using a Fortress. It's it's got sturdy, swift, protect, and toxic spikes. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. I like him. And that's it, isn't it? That's it. Yep. So yeah, our on deck box is kind of packed right now. Um, what I think I'm going to end up doing is, like I said, I'm going to move these eggs into the um, blank spaces that we have or, or try to fill up as many spaces as we can and get this last box open and available and uh, then we'll just have to split it between death box and on deck box until it becomes too full. Then I don't know what the fuck we're, what we're going to do because we just have so many fucking Pokemon on deck right now. I mean, we have two Sneasels, well, we have two Absols, but one's just illegal as fuck so he doesn't even count two sneezels two uh a palms uh the three larvitars is that it those, those are all the duplicates i think those are all the duplicates that we have so far but either way we got a lot of motherfuckers in here <sighs> no let's not continue the box operation <laughs> and then finally uh if you guys missed it that's our party for right now i think for the next episode i'm gonna try and get everyone leveled up to about level 40 or so and before we take on the next gym, because today's gym, if I hadn't put the swords dances up, I think it might have gone a little bit differently. Because we weren't smashing them with one hit. We were taking them down pretty damn low, but we weren't smashing them with one hit. So, might get everyone leveled up, and hopefully Jasmine and her Steelix won't be too much of an issue. But besides that, you guys, I want to thank you for sticking around through all of the fucking mishaps in today's episode. Uh, all the mishaps in what was supposed to be Wednesday's episode. And uh, through all the egg hatchings and all that shit. So thank y'all for that. Smash that like button for me if you did enjoy. Let's see if we can smash a thousand again. That'd be fucking amazing if we could. But either way, I hope you all did enjoy. You know me, YouTube. Nap192. Uh, I'm out.